Hi guys, Snake Dodder here. Welcome to Broken Sword 5 The Serpent's Curse. This is the beta access uh, version, um, as it says in the bottom right hand corner there. Um, yeah, kickstarted this game um, months ago now when it was first announced, when Charles Cecil and the guys at Revolution Software um, first um, announced the game. Been a massive fan of all the Broken Sword games. Currently playing through Broken Sword 1 um, at the moment on my channel. Um, and I've also played a bit of Broken Sword 4, um, but yeah, this is Broken Sword 5 and I want to jump straight in. This has only been released today to uh, to the Kickstarter backers, um, so yeah, let's jump in now. Um, let's have a quick look at the options, make sure there's any subtitles. Yes, there are, that's good. So yeah, let's uh, let's go in now. I want to say a big thank you to um, to Nathan Lord. Um, he uh, uh, on Twitter, his name is uh, is Nathan Lord 89 on on Twitter, and he uh, he told me that the, uh, the 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 beta was available. I hadn't received an email as as of this moment from um, from Revolution. So he yeah he put me he gave me a heads up to let me know that the game was here. So thanks to him, this is now appearing on my channel. So yeah, let's jump in now and start a new game. Uh, yeah, I've, I've played a point and click game once or twice before. We'll uh, we'll ignore the tutorial. But the serpent was wiser than all the animals that were in paradise. And God cursed the serpent and called him devil. And he said, Behold, Adam had been... Blah, 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 blah. Battle not with monsters, lest ye become a monster. And if ye gaze into the abyss, the abyss gazes into you, I think that said, before it went away. Revolution Software. Slightly higher resolution than the last time I saw it. Directed by Charles Cecil. Here we are. Fantastic. Looking good. Like I said, we've been uh, kept informed with the game's development over the last uh, sort of year or so, and uh, yeah, I've been been waiting a long while for this. Catalonia, Spain, 1937. Awesome. That kind of bird harks back to the original Broken Sword, where there was a bird flying off into the distance. So if you've watched the uh, first couple of parts on my uh, first part on my on my channel, you'd have seen that that same kind of cutscene. Let's see what this is all about. Oh, there's soldiers breaking down doors. What's going on? Oh, one down, man down. Oh, this is all kicking off. We must go now. Tiago, go with your mother to the trap. Take this. It will always be your guide. Yes, Papa. Hmm. We will join you shortly. Okay. Shabir, the painting. Quick, get the painting. Mm, that came out of the uh, frame rather easy. Nice looking cutscenes. Huge jump up in that. Uh, oh dear. Huge jump up in graphical. Oh no, it's been shot. Oh, so see. Signora, it is too late. Go. No, Papa! Senor, in here. Evil, so evil man in a hat. Don't know why the subtitles aren't coming on. I'll just check that in a second. Paris, present day. There's the painting. I wonder how it got into the hands Paris of this Swiss. place. Passion, romance. Yeah, here's George. I was working in this guy's got an awesome voice. It paid the rent, just about. And then, by chance, I met Nico at a private view. You didn't tell me that you were back in Paris, George. We should catch up. Let's have lunch. Nobody moves. Oh dear. <laughs> George and Nico don't have much luck when it comes to, uh, to these kind of events. Oh, he's taking the painting. No, monsieur, not la malédiction. Oh, another one down. Stay back. 
Once again, Paris had shown me her dark side. A brutal robbery, a senseless murder. Nico and I were about to Nico's be drawn into taking the new, after the man on foot. Together. Wow, that's a the gallery owner that's a dead. start and a half. Sometimes playing the hero doesn't no. pay. My company had insured the exhibition, so I had a crime to solve. The cops would be here soon. I didn't have much time. Loving the uh, kind of art style there at the bottom. Very familiar. I'm just going to quickly just go um, into the menu and just turn down, if I can, is there a menu? Main menu there. Just want to turn down the, the game uh, audio sound a little bit. I'm going to turn up the speech. Just to give me a better, so you can guys can hear it a bit better. The subtitles obviously on; they just went on for the intro. Let's uh, let's check Henry's body then. The priest was giving last rites to the gallery owner. I didn't want to interfere. Fair enough. Uh, should we look over at the uh, painting? Or the gap where the painting was. This was where the stolen painting had hung. Correct. Why that painting? I know, I know. And why it's got history. The stolen painting had an alarm, which should have sounded when the painting was removed. Yes. I needed to find out why it hadn't. Should we open this doorway? Door up? Aha, look. So that was why the alarm hadn't sounded. A wire had been cut by someone who knew exactly what they were doing. Mm. This was an inside job. Oh my god, it's a mirage. Must be some kind of uh, uh, some kind of achievement, maybe. It was the speaker cone for the alarm. It hadn't sounded when the painting. No, was it started. hadn't. Okay, right. Well, let's uh, let's come out of there. And should we go into the? Can we look at any of these other paintings before we do that? Just ninety thousand for this. Bargain. One. Okay, let's just go into this door. Can we get through? The door was locked with a keypad. Uh. The wires from the camera ran into the room behind. It must have captured the whole robbery. If I could get the code to the keypad, I yes. might be able to shed some light There's on it. There's the camera point. pointing straight at the uh, at the painting. The cable for the camera ran into the room marked private. Okay, so let's see if there's anything in this pizza box. This is what the, uh, the delivery driver, guy with the helmet on, dropped. The thief left the pizza box behind. I wondered what was well, it. Was a, it was a gun before. Pizza. Well, no <laughs> surprise there. Pizza. The guy must have been hungry. There was only one slice left. Should we take the pizza? DNA and stuff. Right. Can we? Pizza's in the thing now. Can we just? The priest was giving. I want to see if we can get the. Uh... No one had noticed the pizza box fall onto the floor. I decided to leave it okay. alone. Is there any codes anywhere? The alarm on that painting hadn't been sabotaged. Okay. So, what made the stolen one so special? Indeed. The bus was balanced precariously on the pedestal. I didn't want to knock it Fair off. Enough. Let's see if uh, Lane, he was in one of the earlier games as well. Uh, let's see if, he, uh, if he's got anything on him. It was Hector Lane, France's greatest art critic. We'd met before. It had George be drugged wrong. him, I think, if I remember rightly. For a moment... I thought he was dead, but from the snoring, I guessed he'd only fainted. Lane was out cold. Can we go in his pockets? I was going to need something to bring him around. What's that? In the pocket was a pair of nail clippers. They were monogrammed with the letters H. Well, that's useful. We'll have those. Anything else? Lane was out cold. Okay. I was going to need something to bring him around. All right, George. So. Champagne, we could maybe use to we shake, wake him with the champagne over the face. Champagne to the face. Uh, now, is there a is there any more clues in here? The poster looked old. I didn't want to touch it. I'm sure there must be something in this room that gives us the code. Can we talk to the priest? Excuse me, Father. For I have sinned many times before, George. Yes, my son. I'm George Stobart. My company insured the exhibition. My name is Simeon. Oh. Is there anything Father I can do? Simeon. You can 
pray for his soul. A senseless murder. On the contrary, this killing makes plenty of sense. What do you mean? A great evil has taken this is the place. work of the devil. This is the work of the devil. What? How did you jump to that conclusion? I am a Dominican priest. I know these things. And now, excuse me, I must pray. Can you not? One can you not pray? Ah, the good. Meal. The next, I was talking. Right, let's get in his pockets. The devil with a priest. Let's ransack the dead man's body. What is this? In Henri's pocket was a tiny bottle. Oh. It was a bottle of bread. Bread. Bread for men. Wake the beast within. Mm. Now there is a crumpled note. There was a Please small piece let that be the code. Dead man's hand. It was too intriguing not to take a look. It read, "2:30 p.m. Ooh. Be ready." Oh. Innocent enough until oh. I realized that the robbery took place at 2:30 p.m. Okay. There was something fishy going on around here, and it wasn't just the canapes. No. I quickly replaced the note. Slip it back. Okay. Anything in his? I didn't want Henri's blood. No, on don't my... do we really? And jacket pockets, trouser pockets. Poor guy. Yeah, that's all you got to say, is it? Shut his eyes. Okay, George. Right. He definitely looked better. Uh, I want. I want a note. Why is there no note? He probably remembers the code, though, doesn't he? Uh, I think we've done everything. Poor yeah. Guy. Done everything there that we can. I put the glasses back where they were. Best to leave the evidence the way I found it. Yeah. <laughs> a cryptic note in a bottle of overpowering cologne. No personal effects or anything else of substance. That weirdly, I definitely needed to check out that yes. office. Weirdly, the site kind of start of the uh, Broken Sword one where um, Nico uh, left the guy's uh, guy's eyes open as well. So it's a similar kind of thing. So we'll do the same there. Why? Right. As they say, every artist was first an amateur. Come on. No, can't go that way. Oh, so how do we get in here? I wonder if there's a... Should we go out? Will he, will he go out? Yes, he will. Okay. I need access. The street was quiet and upmarket. Not the kind of place for an opportunity. <laughs> Just noticed the uh, pissoir. <laughs> a lovely little icon. Fantastic. Right, um... Should you go and look in next door's shop? I've always been a sucker for Parisian stain No. Nope. Oh, maybe we can get into the office this way. George, very clever. The room looked like some sort of office for the gallery. I could just see the glow of the CCTV monitor in the corner. We can't get in, though. Hmm. Okay. Have you got the toilet? You gotta hand it to the French. They know how to take a leak in style. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I'd fancy that much. Just going around a little corner. Um, right, we can go down to the train station. Let's just head down there, shall we, for now? For a moment, I contemplated getting on the next train out of here. But a man was okay, dead. Okay, so we can't leave. To do. We can't leave. We can't go further on that way. Le Lizard Bleu. Okay, so let's go back down this way. Done a grand job with the animations, nice and uh, cartoon-like, loving it. Aha, uh -huh. is this the cafe that we've seen on many a, many a, yes it is, many an occasion. Obviously we've got nothing to do with Nico at the moment, let's, uh, ah, bonjour monsieur. Excuse me. Oui. Monsieur. A very polite waiter. There's just been a robbery at the gallery. Oh, damn it. You don't sound surprised. All property is theft, monsieur. And all art is property. Therefore, all art is theft. Do you not agree? Kind of. Uh, well, uh, when you put it like that, <laughs> it's hard not to. Okay, let's uh, see if he saw the man. Did you see anybody run out of the gallery earlier? There was a beautiful woman with a camera. She was just... That was Nico. Somebody. That must have been Nico. You know her? 
You surprise me. Can you tell me anything about the man she was chasing? I assume, monsieur, that like all of us, he is inherently unknowable. Mm. No wonder this guy's cafe was empty. Okay, let's uh, ask about the guy that owns the uh, The gallery. gallery owner, Henri, was shot dead trying to stop the robbery. Life has no meaning the moment you lose the illusion of being eternal. Hmm. <laughs> Cryptic. Did you know him well? Can we ever truly know another Oh man, just answer the question. He spent little time at the cafe, unlike his friend, Monsieur Lane. Aha. Uh -huh. Maybe we could wake him up. Oh, I could probably smell that bloody thing in his nose, couldn't I? What do you know about Let me ask the questions Lane. first. Lane, oh yes. He drinks here sometimes. He like he, he likes a tipple. Last night, without paying. last night, what sort of time? After midnight, for sure. If you see him, give him this bill and tell him to pay up next time. I will time. do that for you. Come out. Let's take the note out of his pocket. That's very nice. Tidy, tidy graphics. I wondered whether Lane was in a hurry to get somewhere or just trying to skip paying his bill. Okay, that'll do for now. Actually, should we ask about the gallery? What do you know about Le Lizard Bleu? It's bourgeois, vacuous, and overpriced. Just like its curator Lane. He's always in here, you know, talking art to his latest flusier. Okay, right, let's. Uh... Thank you for your consistent and <laughs> Perhaps next time you come, I will give you a coffee. Oh, that's Perhaps. very kind of you. Let's get out of here. And uh, let's get back inside the gallery. Let's see if we can wake Lane up. I just think we'll try using the, uh, we'll try using this spray. Click once and click on the Lane. Does this work? The label read "Awaken the Beast Within." <laughs> well, no harm in trying. Here we go. Oh, big mist of green spray. Here he is. Does the job. It's like, uh, what are those salts called? I don't know what they're called. Uh, uh, they slap under that? your nose. It smells like... like the 70s. <laughs> Where am I? You fainted. Same place you were before. In the gallery. Okay, let's have a chat to him. Welcome back to the land of the living. I wouldn't exactly call this living. Don't just stand there. Get me something to eat. I've had a terrible shock, you know. Well, funny you should say that. How about a slice of pizza? I found a slice of pizza. I asked for food, boy, not a cardboard simulacrum. <laughs> okay. okay, if you don't want it. I didn't say that. Not here. <laughs> okay. Well, two bites, wolf down, gone. Given the circumstances, that was surprisingly acceptable. Uh, now, what's been going on? Yes. Oh. Henri, Henri is, is dead. Dead? Afraid so. Poor chap. Just like him to steal the limelight, <laughs> though. Alright. Uh, code? Excuse me. Please? Do I know yes, you? Yes, just gave you a pizza. Yes, our paths have crossed in the Glees Gallery. Of course. The man would be Ah, absent. that's right, the absinthe. I don't suppose... He was off his face, uh, wasn't he? Afraid not. Off his face. Pity. I'm sorry, but... I'm having trouble remembering your name. I'm George Stobart. I insured the exhibition. <laughs> I hope you have deep pockets then, yes. my boy. Could I ask you a few questions, Mr. Lane? Fire away. Uh, the, uh, the code, yes, let's ask. I don't suppose you know the code to that door, do you? Of course. I uh -huh. am, after all, the curator of this exhibition. But I couldn't possibly give you access to the office. Oh, come on, Lane. Arrive. I figured I wasn't going to get the door code from Lane by playing nice. I needed to try. Okay, let's uh, mention the bill to him. See if he gives in that way. Take a look at this. What of it? It's your bill from the cafe next door. So. <laughs> You sure drank a lot of champagne last night without Come on, let me in. You know you want to. But you told me that you were away from Paris last night. I hate to say it, but that sounds like a lie to me. Tell you what. 
You give me the code to the door, and the police need never know. This is ridiculous. You have no motive and nothing that connects me to the crime. Have it your way. I will get that code. Well, wasn't going to be that easy then. That's a shame. You've already told me one lie, Mr. Lane. You give me the code, and I won't tell the police about the phony alibi. No, I refuse. You have nothing substantive to connect me to this crime. What else have we got? Uh, nail clippers and a cut wire? Someone sabotaged the alarm on the stolen painting. A wire was cut. What? Who could have got into the alarm system? Exactly. It was an inside job, Mr. Lane. You're not suggesting that I... Who, me? Well, I'm afraid that's the way the cops are going to see it. That's preposterous. How could I possibly have cut the wire? Well, funny you should say that. Are these your nail clippers, Mr. Lane? Yes, they have my initials monogrammed on them. Huh. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> George, you have him. The alarm on the stone painting. What are you saying? Well, the alarm was sabotaged, Mr. Lane. It was an inside job. Are you accusing me? How very me? dare you? How dare you? Now, I believe you. I absolutely do. But will the police? You have the motive. There's the evidence. Evidence of sabotage. Along with the gaping hole in your alibi. Done up like a kipper. Look, give me the code for the office, and I can make your problems disappear. You, sir, you, sir. are a blackmailer. Yes. Yep, got it in one. The number is 6397. <laughs> but your accusations have absolutely no substance. I had the code. The police would be here any moment, so I had to Let's work do it. fast. Oh, here they come. Quick. What was that number? Oh, George. 6397. Six, everyone, hold it right there. Damn it. <laughs> here is the police. Is that Inspector Moo again? I am Inspector the behind, the of the Paris officer Mew. Serious Crime Squad, and I hereby declare this crime scene open. I mean, closed. Now, nobody move. Oh, Especially God, you he's on the clueless. Board. Inspector Clouseau. I want a total lockdown. Hey. Nobody in or out. Apart from me, of course. Who's going to stand guard then? There we go. I Let's just see what Nico says. Gallery, but a familiar figure was guarding the door. It was Sergeant Mu. Our paths had yes, they have. The right, I think, guys, I'm going to call it there. That's a little look into the beta of uh, Broken Sword 5. And uh, if you want to see some more... Um, I may well do another video on the beta, but the, the full game is out on December the 4th, December the 5th, only a week or so now, not, not long. Um, so yeah, if you want to see some more, please uh, remember to like, share and favorite the video, leave a comment for me. And uh, yeah, we'll be back soon for some more. Thanks for watching guys, bye bye.